Hello everyone, I'm Jennifer and you're watching Newegg TV. I'm going to be giving you a product overview on this adorable HP Pavilion. Uh, this is the HP 10 Touch Smart Notebook. First, let's take a look at everything that comes in the box. You get a setup instructions quick start guide, a quick warranty guide. Also, they've included a Windows Basic to help you navigate Windows 8 in case you are unfamiliar with it. Also, you get your power cord and connector. And of course, the notebook itself. Let's start with the physical specifications. This is a 3.2 pounds light little notebook and it is best suited for uh, office applications or schoolroom applications where you can't carry too much weight with you. Also great for business trips or any kind of travel where you might want a little bit of an entertainment device. You can just toss it right into your bag and it occupies the same space as a very small book. Across the top we have a 10 point seven four inches at the longest point, 7.66 inches at our width, and we have a height of under an inch at 0.89 inches. Now I'll look at the inside. I've already taken the trouble of setting up Windows 8.1. This is, as I mentioned, a capacitive touchscreen, a 10 inch capacitive touchscreen. And really, Windows 8.1 lends itself to this platform pretty flawlessly. Basically what you have here is a tablet with a keyboard. And since it's such a short distance between the keyboard and the screen, you're not going to have very diff much difficulty at all reaching across it to use the touchscreen capabilities. And with something this small, I, I feel like it really allows Windows 8.1 to shine. A quick word about the internals. So the CPU is going to be an AMD A4 1200 one gigahertz processor. You get uh, two gigabytes onboard memory and an integrated AMD Radeon HD 8180 for your graphics. Also, your hard disk space is going to be 320 gigabytes, which is actually pretty substantial, which is what makes it good for business use or educational use if you're a student. Also, you can store plenty of video or what have you for travel entertainment. But if 350 gigabytes is not enough for you, you get an additional 25 gigabytes free for life in uh, HP's cloud service. Plus, you get free office, home, and student, which makes this a really good value. So here's a really quick look at the keyboard. We have across the top a nice variety of functions. We have all of your media controls as well as the ability to turn wireless, um, your Wi-Fi abilities on and off, as well as dim, brighten your screen, and also to project to another monitor if you would like to connect this. You get a full QWERTY keyboard as well as at the bottom we have your back to windows screen and some page up and page down features which are handy. You have your touchpad right here and uh, yeah I think that wraps that up. Around the outside you have ports for a headphone, you have two USB 2.0, your LAN port as well as your power cable connector goes in here. There is an LED indicating light when you have it in so you know it's charging. On the other side we have HDMI as well as USB 3.0 and some indicator lights for your hard disk. This is a multi SD card reader right here so that you can easily transfer data from say a digital camera or whatever else you might have that uses an SD card. All right, well that wraps up this product overview on the HP Pavilion 10 Touch Smart Notebook. If you've liked this video or found it helpful, please like it and subscribe to our various YouTube channels. Until next time, I'm Jennifer and thank you for watching Newegg TV.